you probably know about it or heard about it. So we wanted to give these guys a few minutes. It won't take long. They'll, they'll take a few minutes. They'll give us a quick demo. And, uh, and uh, I know uh, Coach Hawkins, Chris Hawkins from ASU is in the wings. And uh, he, he'll, he'll be here in a second. So, uh, Mr. Fisher, what you got? It's all yours, buddy. Awesome. Yeah, thanks so much. And really appreciate you guys having me here today. So, yeah, we'll try and take you guys through pretty quickly here. There's a lot to cover. But for those of you guys who don't know uh, games, what GameStrat is, we're sideline instant replay. So that's the live video on the, the iPads during the game, uh, similar to Huddle Sideline. That's what the, the main thing that most people know. Uh, so the biggest difference advantage you're going to get with GameStrat is uh, the most reliable system on the market. So you guys are never going to have drop plays, never going to be losing connection and uh, the fastest video transfer too. So we've been switching a lot of teams from Huddle Sideline and other, some other sideline replay uh, companies as well. Um, but yeah, I'll get to it here and show you guys a few things. Try and keep it pretty quick. Um, so first thing I'll show you here, let's just jump on. I'm going to share my screen a little bit. So this is just our main website here. So like I said, I'm going to try and get through a lot of things pretty quickly. So if you guys have any questions afterwards and whatnot, we've got this contact page here and we'll have a, we actually have a full demo that we did over Zoom uh, a couple weeks ago now. You guys can download on there and it really goes into a lot more detail. Um, so that being said, let's jump in now and I'm going to go to share my iPad here instead because that's sort of the main thing that you guys are going to be seeing on, on the sideline, just exactly what the, a coach would be seeing when, the, when all the plays come in. So you guys should have exactly what my iPad screen shows here now. Um, first thing you'll notice, I've got all these plays coming in, coming in chronological order, most recent one at the top. Uh, and the big difference here, we don't just have ODK, like a lot of sideline replay systems. It's all broken down for you by play number, down, distance, hash, uh, yard line, all that, all that stuff, all those usual um, data points. And then we also break it up by series here. So you can see you've got these page breaks. Um, let me just get a little... Yeah, if you guys can see my mouse here, that'll, that'll sort of point things around. We've got the page breaks here where you guys can see things. And then uh, over up top, you've obviously got your video. This is our two angle system here. So you've got your sideline and your end zone cut. And then over on the left, uh, we've got all of your filters. So we lock you guys to ODK, pretty easy way to flip through all those guys there. Um, and then we also let you guys filter by everything else. So if you want to see, for example, all your second down plays, boom, there's all your second down plays. We've obviously I just got a, a few here for a, a quick demo. Um, all your run plays, bang, you're just seeing just run plays now and you guys can click through those. Um, let's go back here. Now let's pop this open. And one of the things you'll see, this stuff's all preloaded in, but that's exactly the way it's going to show up when you guys are live in a game. So you're never going to be waiting for any downloads or anything like that. Everything hits the iPad and saves. Um, so one of the cool features here with our, once you go full screen is you've obviously got your, uh, your sideline cut here in the in full screen, but in the bottom right-hand corner right over here, you guys will see that... Uh, you've got your end zone cut there. And so to get over to that, there's no loading, there's no going out to over to that or anything like that. You just tap this bottom corner and now you're right there. And so you can, you've got full control here. Might look a little choppy with the, the stream here and the screen share, but uh, you got easily jump back and forth sideline to end zone cut there. And the usual, all your usual controls, you can annotate there. You can draw, draw stuff where this guy's going all that. So all your full controls that you guys are used to. Um, the, the two angle system is something that uh, a lot of coaches really love because some of the other systems I know with huddle sideline, you've sort of load one and you've got to go out and load the other two. So it really slows things down. This is a great way to just really speed things up during the game and make, uh, make everything simple. Another way we uh, make things simple for you guys during the game. So if you look in the top right, there's this little graph icon. All that data you're putting in is constantly getting broke down for you. So you guys have in-game tendency reports. So you can see your run pass splits based on down distance, uh, field position, hash. So you guys know how much you're running the ball in the red zone or how much they're running the ball on you in the red zone if you flip over to defense, um, things like that. So that's constantly updating through the game. And uh, yeah, get a lot of value out of that for sure. Um, so let's go off of there now. I'm going to take it right back. Show you guys a few things on our website that sort of help explain the overall setup and everything with GameStrat too. So we got four packages. Um, really depends on how many angles you guys want to record and uh, where you want to record them from. So you can do one from the press box, one from the end zone, both angles. You can record with an iPad there too. A couple different options. These are all yeah easily accessible on our website, gamestrat.com. Um, then oh, let's break down. So this is what I'll go through a little um, on the recording side and show you guys how you get that video in there, how you get the tags on there. Um, so this is essentially a little diagram that breaks it down. And one of the key things with GameStrat is that we use a laptop to operate from. Um, so when I show you guys the recording, that's going to be just a screen share of my laptop. And that 
operates right up in the press box, connects directly into your camera. And it's one of the main reasons that GameStrat is so reliable and we are able to transfer the video so fast. It's because the laptop's doing all the heavy lifting. It's processing the video. It's storing it there too for an easy export into Huddle um, after the game. You guys can go right up to Huddle or watch game film or anything like that you're using. Um, but yeah, the laptop's really key for that. It's got a lot more power than like a recording iPad or something like that. And so that's where a lot of issues come in um, with some of the other guys there. Um, but that's sort of the, the overview. You guys can have viewing devices down in the field, up in the press box, all hardwired together. Private network too. You guys don't need to have Wi-Fi at your stadium. Um, so that's that's all really, really simple. Everything comes pre-plugged in too. So you guys get one of these cases. Everything comes plugged in together. You just sort of mount it and you're you're good to go. So now let's jump over and I'll show you exactly what GameStrat looks like. So this is what you guys would be running on your laptop during the game. You can see I'm just using the FaceTime camera here. So you're just seeing me again. Um, but this is what will be connected to your, your existing camera that you guys are filming the game with. Wouldn't change your filmer's job at all. We just go right into the HDMI port. Like I said, really simple setup. And then your GameStrat guy who's doing this is doing his own start stop recording. He's operating independently here. Um, and then what you can see over here on the left is all of our, all of our tags. So we've got quarter, ODK, series, play number, down distance, all that stuff you saw on the iPad that you're going to get those breakdowns of. You can also export this all into to a huddle after the game. You can export the film and these tags. So once you've got them in, you just use this little button over here. It's going to pop open your, your finder here with all of your game film. You got your angle one, angle two, and your breakdown data there. So that's a really easy just drag drop to, to do the upload to huddle. And we actually have a blog available. Um, on our website too that breaks that whole process down for you. But with these tags too, I know it looks like a lot. So if it is something that maybe you guys aren't interested in and you just want the bare bones, you want video, you can turn all these guys off. We recommend keeping the top three on just because they kind of um, run themselves. Um, but a lot of it does actually automate itself here. So I'll flip these back on and do just a few quick examples. So if I start recording now, you're gonna see that it's recording. Um, right now we're first and 10, we're on the third series, first play. Let's say it was a run. You can tag this while we're still recording. Now we're gonna stop the recording. And now before we confirm and send the video down, it's gonna give us a chance to, to look over these tags here. So I can change my ending yard line. Let's say we're new spot of the ball is at 39. So now boom, I confirm that. It updates. Now we're second and six, it's the second play of the drive and we're on the 39 yard line. It's doing all the mental math for you, all the calculations. So um, something really simple to do. We've trained guys up like just whether it's a JV kid or an injured player, there's a there's always a way to, to get it done and one of those things that you guys can start with a few tags and then as the season goes on add a few more and as they get more comfortable pretty uh pretty steep learning curve with all that stuff but um you can see this dashboard up at the top too we've got all our my uh, my ipads up here connected too so it's a really good way for this guy to be sort of in charge and and monitor everything that's going on um so i'll stop that actually let's go back to the website here quickly i won't take too much more of you guys time here at all just want to do show you like one more time. If you guys have more questions, want to reach out. Like I said, this demo right up here, you guys can access it. It goes um, into way more detail. We had some Q&A with that too, as we were live. So there's a, a lot of more detail about all these features there. If you have any specific questions, just hit this contact form, send it over. You guys can feel free. There's a uh, sales number, support number, send us an email, really however you can fill out the form too. And we'll get back to you guys right away. Um, also, we put out a lot of our stuff on Twitter, all our new blogs, like I said, all available on Twitter. So give us, come give us a follow. We'll follow you guys back too. So you don't have to worry about that. Um, all our information's up on there. And then even if you guys are looking to just do some research on your own, the blog page is all there too. So um, yeah, that's pretty much everything I had. Wanted to say uh, thanks again for, for having us on. Try to make this as quick as possible. Get you guys moving on to your next speaker here. But uh, yeah, really appreciate the time and, uh, and everybody's uh, being here today. Great, Mr. Fisher. Thank you very much, Ben. Uh, there's one. There's a couple of things here. One of them. How uh, how many people do you need to run this or demand this? Do you, and do you need Wi-Fi? So just one person to run the whole system, whether you're using one or two angles, and no Wi-Fi necessary. So that case that I I showed there um, earlier comes pre-plugged in, and that's going to have your own private uh, network. So we're going to set up a private network in the stadium for you. Um, it doesn't really matter how big your stadium is, how small. We've worked in college stadiums, pro stadiums. Um, and so, yeah, no need for Wi-Fi. That's all taken care of. Sounds good. Well, thank you, uh, Ben, with GameStrat. We appreciate it.
you know, I, I hear a lot of good things about uh, your product. I haven't been able to to to, to uh, demo it at our school or our program yet, but but I know I've talked to a lot of guys and a lot of guys Hopefully have uh, said a lot of, a lot of good things about it. So so um, yeah, so I, I'm sure guys will be reaching out to you. Hopefully, uh, you know, get, get some questions from, from some other guys later and and look at uh, look at uh, getting game strat in your program. So thanks again, uh, Ben. I appreciate it. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you guys very much. Yeah. Reach out with any questions.